And speaking of tours. Yes, we got a very big festival upon us. Yes, we do. Dreamville Dreamville. lineup was dropped. Yep, so the Dreamville lineup has dropped in a Dreamville festival will be April 6th through 7th uh, uh, next month in Raleigh, North Carolina, Dorothea Dix Park. Lineup uh, has some artists that are pretty big, so they have it over two days. Sexy Red will be there. Uh, (laughs) (laughs) Fellas, make sure to get your COVID and AIDS test. But um, Saturday, they're going to have SZA performing, Chris Brown, Jid, Little Yachty, Schoolboy Q, Sexy Red, Jeremiah, uh, Earth Gang, Tizo Touchdown, who is Amare, Loot, La Tyler, and Domain. Now, I, I'm not familiar with all those artists. Saturday's going to be kind of dope. Yeah. Saturday. I hope they broadcast dope. Chris Brown's performance like they did Usher's last So, year. my question with that one before we go to the other day is... Sis is the headliner? SZA is the headliner above Chris Brown. Hold I don't on. think that means, I don't know. Oh, see, okay, no. See, what I think it is is they just put SZA name over Chris Brown. They're both, in, you know, highlighted big. So yeah. I'm thinking that Chris Brown got to be the headliner. Like, SZA is going to do the open and Chris Brown's going to close it, like how Usher did last year. Because ain't no damn way that SZA yeah. coming on after Chris Brown. Chris Brown is closing it <laughs> there down. There ain't no way that SZA, and I like SZA. Yeah. And I know there's going to be a lot of people there who love SZA. But Chris Brown is it. That's like probably yeah, going to be. That, I'm expecting that to be the best performance of Dreamville is Chris Brown. Uh, who's going to help Chris Brown? Okay, who's on the next day? It don't matter. Who, but okay, call, but we're going to go to the next day. day. Okay. Um, The next day is J. Cole, of course, performing. He's just got to drive up the street. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Nicki Minaj is, those are going to be the two co-headliners. So it's going to be J. Cole and Nicki Minaj. Then we got Rima. I don't know who that is. Jeezy. Yay. Monica. Ray Shremin. Key Glock. Bass, money long, Kaz. Yo, don't don't fly over her like that. Money long. Don't you I dare, don't, don't, don't you don't do dare fly over like her that. name like that. You put some emphasis <laughs> well, when you say her name. I was actually going through the lineup when you rudely interrupted. <laughs> I can understand you fucking up Ray Shrimmer name and all that. I don't give a fuck. You know that's Ray Shrimmer and money long. Mess up but, their name. but you better put some put some emphasis on money long, nigga. Okay, I don't. I've heard her do yeah. more freestyle, and okay. You put some emphasis when you say money long. Okay. I'm going to tell you what. Remember my boys who came through here the other day that sat in with us on the pod? Yeah. They were a little disappointed that what's recall wasn't coming. Who? That Ice Spice wasn't coming. I'm not. I know they are. They, they were disappointed that Ice Spice wasn't coming. Tell them to get talk. better taste in women. That, I mean, they, they still got a hell of a lot okay, of Okay, so hold on. Let me finish. We have Kaz, we have Omen, Tia, Corrine, and Chase Shakur. Now, I'll admit, there's about eight people on here I am completely never heard of. familiar with and never heard of. Somebody got to do some filler. Yeah. Somebody got to well, do I mean, some filler. I, I'm just not familiar with Oh, them. it's going to be a lot of filler. It's gonna yeah. be, remember, you got all these other acts, these, these I and I hate to, to, to title them local Independent. You got all these independent acts. They're you know not going to be at Dreamville. Yeah, they are. What? Like, they're going to be at Dreamville performing and shit like that, but they're just like, they're independent. They're not going to have like that big ass hype behind them and shit. It's going to have oh, to be. Oh, you talking niggas. about the ones in the lineup? Yeah. 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 Well, I mean, they, they ain't local or nothing. I thought, okay, I, I don't think, recognize I think. Them. I think Cole gonna have the best set, but I don't. I, I could I could see Chris Brown. I could see Chris Brown first. I don't know. Does SZA do dancing and her shit? I'm about to say I think SZA should have. She should have between her. No, nah, and, and, and this is, is another gone. thing. See, you got Nikki here, and Chris Brown is fucking phenomenal, man. Like <laughs> yeah. I don't know if y'all ever <laughs> seen this nigga before. Like, <laughs> oh, my face changed. Like, I'm sorry. Nigga, like, I see if this we thought when I went to Usher Vegas. was amazed last year, I saw I saw Chris Brown in Vegas, man. When I tell you for the few minutes he was out there, dog, amazing, I, bro. You were popping. I was out there popping, nigga. Like <laughs> the fuck. Let's see if you can run it, run it. Okay. If you thought Usher was amazed last year. Chris Brown's going to be amazing. Yeah, he he really is. I think Usher's better at a uh, better show than Chris Brown, but I think Chris Brown is right and there this neck is, and neck. This is another thing about this J Cole thing that I don't think people are playing into it. Drake going to be there. Uh, Drake's going to be there. 
He's going to be there. They are on like too that. much of a run right now where Drake does not show up to support this man's festival. I just don't believe it. And they just they've been doing all these songs together. Yeah. I cannot see Drake not showing up at Dreamville. I can. Year. You acting like Drake just up the street I like Cole. Say, no, no, no. The reason I say is, A, you got songs with, with J. Cole, and, of course, you got songs with Nicki. I can see it being kind of like it was last year where Wayne and them pop up again. They might not, but I could see them popping up again. I ain't going to hold my breath on that. But um, tickets are kind of expensive. I do see <laughs> <laughs> the two-day general admission ticket at the very bare bones basic level is three hundred dollars. So that's going to cover two-day general admission, with the most expensive being the MVP VIP, which will be two thousand dollars a person. And I was reading what what you get, and it was saying food choices for purchase from local chefs, restaurants, including vegan, vegetarian, and gluten-free options. Why would I have to purchase food if I'm uh, the fucking uh, MVP <laughs> VIP ticket that I just paid two thousand dollars. They should be they should be bringing food. Like, yeah, I'm like I gotta they, buy food, food after paying two thousand dollars. What yeah. I do when I do these uh these type of uh, music festivals in Jamaica, nigga, you hey. hey. Food, food drinks. Should be walking like food by, and like drinks. They should be walking by me. I should no, just be reaching my hand and out. drinks, nigga. Like good catered food and good For drinks. two grand? Yeah. Yes. It better be set up when I get uh, out there. Like You it better- get free water stations, uh, free water stations and specialty <laughs> items from art vendors for purchase throughout the fa- uh, fest. <sighs> That's why I'm not paying for the two grand. Yeah. That's why I'm, I'm- Access to both festival entrances on the east and west side. You get a dedicated VIP entrance, a VIP viewing area, a VIP bar, also VIP access to the bathroom, and a commemorative VIP laminate, Two and a grand. Dreamville Fest hat and bandana. Two grand. And access to the premium viewing deck, an exclusive super VIP bar plus lounge where I'm sure they'll make you buy more shit. Two so grand. yeah. So after I paid two grand to go to this, then I'm probably gonna have to pay another five, okay. six hundred dollars no, just to eat, and <laughs> just enjoy drink. the event. Yeah, you gotta buy shit. But I get to go to the bathroom first. Yeah, <laughs> nigga. If I pay two thousand dollars and have access, to hey, it. now I've been to these things. Don't you don't <laughs> Look, know? Don't knock it. Don't, don't knock it. Don't, hey, a bathroom. I think about how many people are gonna be there. You're talking about a private. Look, bathroom? I remember. I remember that picture that they showed last year. Like, yeah. So I guess being able to go to the bathroom first is definitely a perk. Yeah, uh, yeah. You get to- or just to have clean. Uh, make sure it's clean. Maybe somebody's cleaning up after each person uses it. Mm-hmm. Like, dude, dude. And that's why I hate. I hate the fact that. I'm not like a lot of these other niggas that never been outside the country, and I know what things should look like and, and how you should be catered to when you spend money, nigga. I'm talking about when we go, when I go to these festivals. You got people, you'll use the bathroom. People, a person will walk in right behind you, clean that shit up before the next person. Now we wait, and it'll be thousands of people. They go so smoothly. All these Santa, Santa, uh, Santa, sanitization stations and shit to make sure people. That shit don't happen here, dog. No. It don't. No. It's going to be, and you know, it's going to be ultra madness <laughs> at that show because it always is. But it's going to be great music, though. It's going to be phenomenal music. The music going to be amazing. Be prepared. Oh, the city's going to be amazing. Yeah, that be prepared for the internet to go down in the city. Hey, and just so y'all know, masquerade parties that weekend too. So Dreamville going on. I got the masquerade hey. party going on that weekend. Well, what kind too, of masquerade man? party? I haven't heard about this. It's the same. Same that we do we every year, every <laughs> the one we do the every one year. Never show up oh. to my ma- the annual. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was there. I was there. I was there. I thank you. Don't do. I don't show up to no shit that requires up. a mask. I think this year is going to be a Samaforo though. I, I don't think we're doing an assignment. I think we're going to do my face is handsome, and I don't want to cover it up. You don't have to cover up your whole face. You got me in there hiding my handsome face behind a mask with all these women in here. That's why I don't go to that shit. I don't want to put a mask on. Women need to see the. The eyelashes. That's what I got going for me. 